when I'm struggling to find peace, I only can find in Jesus. When I'm struggling to find solace, I only can find in Jesus. Nothing can compare to Jesus. Nobody can compete with Jesus. Jesus is the only way, truth and answer to God. When I'm struggling, to find peace, I only can find in Jesus. When I'm struggling to find solace, I only can find in Jesus. Nothing. Jesus is the only way, truth and answer to God. With Jesus, I am fear free. Even walking alone in the With Jesus I find peace, with Jesus I find solace, even life is tough and uncertain. Only Jesus is the answer to my love. Only Jesus is the answer to my safety. Jesus leads me out of darkness. Jesus Answer to my truth and safety, peace and solace. How about you? <laughs> I create this song, Jesus. 
Oh Jesus, you are the answer to my life. Jesus, oh Jesus, you are the answer to my safety. <laughs> Only Jesus, you can find the path to God the Almighty. <laughs> Since He shows you the way, He never forced you. Since He gives us free will. He just shows us the way. Unlike human, they like to use force, mandatory, <laughs> so you can obey to them. And then they create fear, <laughs> not love. Well, Jesus is so kind. He, is, he has the kindred soul, so he only opens the way and then shows us the path to truth and happiness. So if you want to stay happy, embrace Jesus and love instead of finding someone since nobody can compare to Jesus. Nobody can uh, compete with Jesus. <laughs> While the moron nowadays, they are seeking everywhere for someone to complete them instead of embrace Jesus. <laughs> nowadays, especially after, after the COVID-19, people are getting error mind, <laughs> rotten brain. <laughs> Sorry, I do not mean to belittle anybody, but look everywhere, or you read in the news. Every day, people uh, murder their friends, their partner, their uh, business partner, just because their mind has been programmed <laughs> to the evil. <laughs> Satan has um, overpowered their mind, control their brain, so they cannot stay focused and then stay uh, in love frequency, but they get out in the wrong way. Either you are women or men, I tell you the secret to happiness. Before you fell in love, sorry, fall in love with yourself. You love yourself unconditionally. You cannot find partner since you are going to create more trouble for yourself and the other partner. <laughs> love means sharing, not demanding or uh, forcing someone to. <laughs> To, to love you. It is not the way love works. Love works in a, a peaceful way, in a peaceful manner. Uh, follow Jesus and you see how Jesus has sacrificed his life. He's willing to die on cross just to save humanity, to cleanse our sin, to redeem our sinful deed, the word sins, he's willing to bear all the sin of this humanity just to save us, while in fact we are fighting, we are competing, we are struggling, we are uh, blackmailing, we are going to murder our <laughs> our peers just for our ego. It is a no no way. Jesus never teach you love like that. It is Satan. It is Luciferian. Therefore, try to stay tuned in the love energy, love frequency. Never ever enter a relationship 
if your partner is not someone who has vibrate in the same energy if you chase or desperately looking for and for somebody to be with you you are creating your nightmare after nightmare <laughs> this is not uh, this is not a hoax but this is real uh, this is a moral lesson for all of you people nowadays they never respect each other even in the dating field more effort in the online dating people are targeting the object <laughs> object of money object of material uh, pentacles they never care whether uh, the men respect them or not they just mm, cross the boundary and then uh, accept the offer desperately uh, accepting the invitation to go uh, in a hotel to meet in the uh, mall or to meet in the public uh, services building it is a no respect to women in the old days men they are going the way the hard way i mean to find you even you are in the rapid hole if they fall head over heels with you so never ever accept an invitation if the man is not willing to come to your house you are not supposed to lower your standard to go out dating especially in hotels it is not a clean or safe place to date what are people doing in a hotel just doing the physicality sex so sex so end up with murder <laughs> it is your uh, stupidity it is your own false if you are willing to accept the invitation go to the hotel and end up with a bloody murder remember the song scott kaloon uh, kaloon scott sorry <laughs> I will climb every mountain and swim every ocean. I will climb every mountain and swim every ocean just to be with you, not just mm, asking you out without respect and then you uh, follow suit. You are desperately accepting the offer and later on blame on the other party, on men. If a guy like that he is acting not uh, according to our custom so why should accept uh, blindly men should have should ex respect women's boundary they have to come to your house uh, in a gentle way not uh, being hypocrisy hide and seek in a hotel what are they willing to do there <laughs> dating like that it is immoral i tell you so never uh, uh, be attached to a man if the man is not uh, credible he doesn't have his act together he never have moral uh, fail you so why should you go and chase him let him go wherever he wants to you have to love yourself and then you remember you create your own reality not him or other people 
even Jesus just show you the way he never forced you either to follow the light or the dark you have your freedom to choose therefore create your own reality and then respect yourself never ever uh, be attached to someone or find happiness outside create from within uh, remember everything in this world happens since it should happen that way we cannot change anything outside unless we start changing inside I have repeated it many times that change in the world start from changing inside so do inside and then do your inner work respect and love yourself first before you go out and then finding partner do not believe that marriage is the solution to your problem and then you are desperately fine fall in and fall out of love and nobody is going to respect you until you respect yourself so if men said that they are busy cannot come to your house and then they invite you to meet outside let them go and find the partner that they can accommodate their requirement do not lower your standard it is a red flag that the men don't respect you even though it is trending nowadays you go against the mainstream <laughs> do not blindly just follow the mainstream even though they condemn you as being old-fashioned never mind I never accept men who invite me to meet outside it shows that they only halfway meeting you halfway what for they have to wholly invest it in you and only you not just seeking ventures seeking adventure and then you are just the object of trial and error even though people said that you are just an old fashion or whatever they claim to be let them say it is their free will and then you just do your way create your own reality that you want to achieve that is the way Jesus wants us to bring happiness and peaceful not to bring chaos and then war and conflict and murder and revenge and then your current class and that's why I said that uh, we're going in circle look what happened to people if they murder someone they are going to come back and then to play the reverse role so do not believe what is written use your logic use your higher intuition sorry connect to God and ask him what is the best way do not just uh, follow the mainstream listen to the media the media is the sources of evil but you are creating and contributing evil if you follow it it is not the fault of the media but it is the fault of you and you and me and us since we give our power to them like you give your power to the men who invite you to meet at the hotel at the conference room at the mall it is not a meeting place for that thing if they want and they like you they have to come to you that is the way gentlemen do the dating not dating like um, hide and seek 
playing hide and seek like the kids. <laughs> it shows they are jerk, they are immature, cannot handle uh, one woman only. They think should be uh, also partnership or relationship is uh, one man, one man, woman, or one woman, man, not many men, women, <laughs> or many women, men. You won't like that. And then he will flirt around, leaving you after uh, using you, since you also willing to contribute, giving your body to be trial and error. Your body is your holy temple, as Jesus said. Follow me, I am the truth, and the only truth is Jesus. Jesus, oh Jesus, you are the answer to my love. Jesus, oh Jesus, I love you forever and forever. That is the answer, not finding the answer in your partner or your spouse or your happy or your flirting partner. <laughs> that is no, no go, no touch, <laughs> no visiting. Hmm, don't you believe me? It's up to you. You have your free will. I'm just giving you solution since I'm tired of people getting uh, mind control and then end up with bloody murder since uh, one partner the woman want money and then the man want sex and then they meet in the hotel and end up with bloody murder so get you fool <laughs> I do not mean to criticize but to, to give you a a wonderful lesson of life. Stick inside and partnership to be with the right one who respect you, body, mind, and soul, not just um, taking advantage of your body and then uh, your soul be, uh, be fragmented. If the, uh, I mean, Cut you to pieces. <laughs> cut you to pieces. After killing you, cut you to pieces. And then your soul will be fragmented. You even cannot travel back to God. I tell you. Think of about that. Consider that. It is very vital that if you die like that, your soul is fragmented into pieces any particles, not just one whole soul, but has been fragmented and dispersed everywhere. How come you you find light? Who don't you believe me? It's up to you. <laughs> At least I have uh, I have uh, exposed what happened nowadays and what solution? Solution is in you, you and me and us, not the authority, not God. Even God cannot help you if you decide to go for the wrong path. <laughs> okay, uh, next time I'm going to create another video for you to motivate you to be a wonderful, wonderful being. See you. Bye-bye. Sending you lots of love and love.